all the details. I mean, we see the scenes there in New York. They've got record-breaking amounts of snow there. It's amazing. It is amazing. We're a week to go before Christmas Day. We're not going to see scenes like that, though, are we? We've basically never seen scenes like that. And I know there's loads of children up and down the country praying for things like that. It's cold enough maybe next week for the odd flake of snow. But we've got some incredible pictures, some more snow pictures from New York. That for us here, it is not looking like it's going to happen. That's what it's week until Christmas. And what we need here is just one flake of snow to fall in that 24 hours of Christmas day to make it a white Christmas. But those Dickensian scenes are a distant memory. We actually last saw one flake of snow just a few years ago. But 50 of the last 61 have actually been white with that one flake of snow, but not those widespread scenes that some are hoping for. But the outlook for today, a very different one. It is mild it is wet and it is windy. First thing this morning, a lot of cloud covers the UK and it's that that acts like a blanket, keeping in that heat. But the cloud thickening from the west and this is bringing with it some very heavy rain. Heavy enough, in fact, for the Met Office to issue an amber warning for the south of Wales for how heavy and relentless the rain will be with saturated ground. It brings the risk of flooding and the river levels are responding. So definitely stay tuned to the forecast and the flood warnings in your area. The southwest of England covered by a yellow weather warning. Again, a lot of spray on the roads here as we head through the day. The whole system moves eastwards. It clears Northern Ireland by this afternoon. Sunny skies and scattered showers here. The far southeast stays dry well until this evening, but overcast, grey and grim. But the rest of the UK, cloudy, wet and windy for most of daylight hours today. As we head through this evening and overnight, that weather front makes slow progress across the country, heading its way eastwards, further spells of heavy rain pulses in that as it moves its way northwards. The wind's driving it through as well, so a blustery night to come because of the cloud, the wind and the rain. These are overnight temperatures, eight to 10 degrees. That's higher than where they should be by day at this time of year. So we start our Saturday on a cloudy, overcast, gray note, wet and windy weather moves its way eastwards. The rest of the day dominated by sunshine and showers. And that's pretty much how Saturday and Sunday look. So a sunny sky, then the rain comes through, then sunshine returns, it's mild through the weekend, but colder into next week, Charlotte. Laura, thanks very much. Good morning to you. It is a week until Christmas and the signals are that things are set to turn cold. But will it be the all important flake of snow? Perhaps one or two, but not the whiteout that some of us perhaps are hoping for. But the weather for the next few days is dominated by change. It's turning wetter, it's turning windier. But today it is very mild. That's because a lot of cloud has moved in overnight and it means temperatures start way above freezing. But from the west, this thicker cloud here heralds the change, heralds the rain that is set to make it a wet and windy day for many, particularly in the west. We have warnings from the Met Office, a yellow one for rain in the southwest, but an amber one for South Wales. The rain here will be torrential, a lot of rain in a short space of time with very saturated ground. This brings the risk of flooding, so stay tuned to your local weather forecast and the Environment Agency's website to see the risk of flooding where you are. As we head through the day, this wet and windy weather makes its way eastwards. It doesn't reach the southeast until the evening and overnight, clearing from Northern Ireland by this afternoon, and temperatures today 12 to 13 degrees, so that is mild but though the what mild went out will the rain win out well let's take a look at our seven day outlook where our weekend remains always in view a look at next week and we are just knocking on the door of christmas eve there this is the look for the north across scotland northern ireland the north of england north of the humber average temperature line here one thing we can see is it's mild and then it turns colder as we head into the week before Christmas. With regard to our rainfall, there's a lot of uncertainty for the week ahead. Weather systems queuing up. At the moment, a heavy band of rain moves through today, a high chance of getting wet. A lower chance through the next few days and into the weekend, particularly on Tuesday. But into next week, we slowly see a climb in our rainfall, a hint it could turn wetter as we head into Christmas. The fortunes further south for England and Wales away from the north of England, so south of the Humber. Again, it's mild, a cooling trend with our weather as we head into next week. Percentage chance of rainfall, again, we continue with this roller coaster ride. It is wet as we head through today. The next few, the risk of showers, a heavy band of rain on Monday. Watch out for that. But hints, it's drier into next week.